What is going on YouTube? Obi Rose Kenobi here. And when we last left off, we fought the fat chocobo and we got our behinds handed to us. Now, what we're going to go ahead and do is we're actually going to go ahead and tackle this again. Uh, hopefully we can beat her this time and uh, it should be fun or him or, you know, it's just a chicken. Um, I'm trying to remember what it was weak to. If I remember correctly, it wasn't weak to anything, but I think I have the fire set up on my, I guess I can look. That, that should be the smartest thing to do. We're going to go ahead and we're going to look at it. But we're going to get this fat chocobo summoning materia, as you can see. We're going to go ahead. We're going to mess with Chadley. We're just going to go right in. We're going to dive right in. Let's just go ahead and dive right in. Then I invite you to ready your <sighs> portable battle simulator. <sighs> All right. Now, as we go ahead, we jump into this battle. We now see Fat Chocobo. Now, let us go ahead and let's run right up and let's just get a good strategy right away. Let's, we're gonna the, the, the best way it seems to beat this is to straight stagger from the rip. So let's go ahead, lock on for the fire adder, fire or fur a, as I like to call it, and we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna hop out the way. Now, there's going to be three stages, as in any true Dark Souls game, stages to your boss, you know. Now, instead of using the fire, fire, fur A, we're going to go ahead and use the fire. And we're going to get this thing as pressured as fast as possible. We're going to use one more fire. Calling fire. Alright, and now, with that being said, we're going to go ahead, we're going to use Eric, and she's going to go ahead, and she's going to have to hit Fat McFaster. With a blizzard, and I am going to hit him one more time with a fire. Ooh, and it did not. I thought it was going to stagger. It really did not. So let's go ahead and hit him with some thunder. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, now he is staggered. You're now with him staggered. Let's go ahead and get in operator mode and just mash, mash, mash. Kind of like. Let's go ahead, stagger this thing left and right. Hit it as much as we possibly can. And we're gonna go ahead and... There we go, hit it with some focus thrust. And now that that has been done, let's go ahead, let's take out the balls around them because these things will seriously destroy you. So, something that's really cool, make sure you keep an eye on your health, you got Aerith. So she's going to go ahead and cure me up right away as he does his roll. I'm going to try to get near his balls when he does that roll. Brazen! Ah, We're going to try to get near the fireballs. Balls of fire! And this does go ahead and seem like me. Yeah. Not cool. That thing literally is just bouncing all over the place. Let's go ahead and get use a high potion right away. I potion myself up and we are gonna you know what we're gonna do we are gonna actually bring in right now e free let's go ahead let's bring him in the game duty call said that wrong let me know in the comments the pressure of pushing down on me pushing down on you I am a no under pressure oh, I don't know guys I didn't even get that excited let's go ahead and oh. There we go. Let's use the summoning ability right now as we go ahead and put on the plus queen under pressure. This song is so great though. Seriously, look it up. Under pressure by Queen. You guys may better know the song as Vanilla Ice, Ice Baby. Just throwing it out there. Oh man, here we go. We're going to go ahead and now we got Aerith in on this. We're going to go ahead and get her to use her blizzard on Fat Chocobo. And it looks like we are now entering into phase... It is my I want to pay it. But I know one thing, those things right there, especially this thing, thing will wreck you. Let's go ahead, let's heal myself up real quick. Let's use a high potion. I kind of really don't want to do, but I might not have a choice. <laughs> I love how E3 is fighting this, and what I really need 
is to fight the fat Chocobo. Did he just, it looked like he farted fire. Did anybody else see that? It wasn't just me, right? Let's use the Radiant Plume. Fat Chocobo, it's over for you. Let's see what that looks like. Let's get out the way. Don't think so. And he just used to, he tried to use the Radiant Plume. No, 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 oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that thing is insane. Let's go ahead and cure Cloud up. And as we go ahead, let's try to go ahead and build this. Oh, uh, looks like it's over. And what a shout. Ooh, 3098 it looks like we did damage. Which would have been even better, honestly, if I could have got him pressured. But it didn't work. So, whatever. We're going to go ahead and attack that Chokey. Roll out of there. Now, what you want to kind of do is you want to attack and roll out. That way you can hit the fire on him. I mean, make you see that ball? Steer very clear of that thing. As you can see, I'm kind of rolling in. I rolled in between to try to avoid the big balls. Um, and then I'm going to roll around. As you can see, this thing is insane. All right, now. We're going to go ahead and we're going to hit the fire on Fat Choke, but oh, come on. There we go. Hit it with the, we're going to try to get this thing staggered one more time. Does Aerith have anything? She sure does. Let's go ahead and hit it with the blizzard. And perfect. And we're going to go ahead and we are actually going to heal myself. That's perfect. That worked out. We're going to roll in there as he rolls. Ooh, look at that. See? That's what I'm talking about. We're trying to get him to roll over his own people and bounce on them, but it's not working. So, we're going to go ahead. We'll, ah, I tried to get in between. Ah, we need it. We need it. We definitely clearly need to get out of there. Got to go ahead and heal myself, actually, because if I don't... I'm using way too many potions on this thing. I'm being as aggressive as possible. And it's just like driving me insane. And now it is finally staggered. And are you serious? Wow. This is straight staggered and I fell unconscious. That is a shame. Let's go ahead. Let me get a Phoenix down ASAP on Cloud. Let me switch over to Cloud, okay. and let me get out the way, and wow, I lost a mad time. That makes me highly, highly upset as we're entering into stage three of this fight. Let's roll out of the way, and let's go ahead right away. Oh, I don't have enough. Yo, that jump is insane. Cloud's going to need a high potion right away. I need to go ahead and heal. Eric does need to heal. The only way that's going to happen though is to go ahead. And there he goes again. Alright. We got these things chasing us all around. And he just fell on Eric. We need to go ahead and get as close as we can. Get a hit in, and we need to get Aerith up right away. So we're going to go ahead, and we're going to give her a high potion. Because I can't go on without her. All right, cool. Now that she's up in the crowd, let's get her to throw a blizzard at Fatty McFat Fat. Yo, that is insane. That, <laughs> like, oh, here he goes with the ball. Aerith, I need you. Ah, uh, Aerith, no! We're not dying here. I refuse to die. I refuse. I refuse. I refuse. All right, so with that being said, let's go ahead. Let's wake Aerith up right away. Let's get her the Phoenix down. You okay? And let's go ahead and switch over to Aerith. And as we switch over to Aerith, we have a limit? which we need to use right now. We're gonna use, ooh, and we finally and get the beautiful on. animation of the healing wind. And she you has now healed me and up and her. As you can see, that was so beautiful. Such a beautiful animation. 
let's go ahead and let's get the fire on Fat Choke Choke. Right. And let's go ahead and dodge out the way of that. Dodge again. Try to get far away. And we're going to go ahead and get Arif to go ahead and hit him with the Blizzard with Blizz Blizz. And she hits him. As you can see, I am trying myself right now to go ahead and pressure Fat with Fat Fat. And it looks like he's getting pressured. Alright. Alright. Please stop rolling into me. Lovely. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and switch over to Aerith right away. And we're gonna hit the Blizzard. You know, you guys remember when McDonald's came out with Blizzard? Oh no, that was Dairy Queen. And we're gonna go ahead and hit the fire on the chocobo. Yes, he is staggered! Let's go ahead, go to Cloud, and Cloud is, are you serious right now? Are you, like, this is happening. All right, come on. Hit the focus thrust, and we're gonna go ahead and hit the focus thrust again. And we're going, come on, we almost got it, we almost got it! We almost got it! It is going down for the count! Focus thrust! Yes! We got the victory. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, Fatty Big Fat work, Fat Cloud. has been this is proof that the universe has a sense of humor. Now that you have a fun new partner in Fat Chocobo, you can work together to squash Shinra like a bug. Whew. Not gonna lie. It's kind of invigorating. Now that we have beat Fat Chocobo, your future battle intel submissions. let us go ahead immediately go to materials and equipment and let's go ahead. Aerith, oh, she already has a materia. Who does she have? She has the Chocobo and Moogle materia. Let us go ahead and change that out with Fat Chocobo. <laughs> yeah, she's going to use Fatty Fat and we're going to be happy with that. I rhymed fatty fat and that. Alright, now that that has been all said in Dizzy Un, let's go ahead, let's see where we're at. Um, let's go ahead, let's see, where do we, where are we headed? Uh, looks like we're headed straight. Let's go ahead and head up to the palace of, I believe this is Don Corneo, Don Cornelio, I don't know. But we're gonna come up here and see what he's got going on. He can't mess with our mojo. We just yeah, took out yeah. Fat Chocobo. Uh, I promise you, I did I not write that. Like, it just him. came out. And he's a gaudy one. Yeah. All right, let's go ahead. Let's hold this. Ooh, three little ninjas. Hi, I'm Chris. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. Ooh, we're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Huh. Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute. Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on. Can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're going to need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Oh, okay. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Alright, <laughs> so this is where it gets very interesting now that we've come here and have been denied access we get to go three places so first and foremost let's go see chocobo sam he's when we first came in and let's see what chocobo sam has to say to us 
At the same time, there are going to be side missions in this area, so I am going to go ahead. Up, oh, let me shut up. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas. Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. Alright. So now that we have gone ahead and we've got... Ooh, look at this. Let's go ahead and grab this. Let's see what this is right here. Oh, we just got 1,200 gil, which is a good thing. And now that we've got our 1,200 gil, let us go ahead. Let's see. We are going to run, I think I said Chocobo Sam, right? Might as well we first came in. I believe that was down this way. Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, perfect. Don't want to go in there. <laughs> let's go ahead. And if I remember, this is where we came in. Yep, because that dude's wearing glasses. Oh, Sam, see what he's got to say. Not you two again. I told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, hear us out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty, please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time we'll be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa, and she's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Hmm. Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> yes, wrong. And you'll leave me in peace. Let's go with tails. Tails. Head. That sucks. Should pick hey, that. don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gal. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio and not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. <laughs> Mio. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? the wall market way lesson learned still cheating all right with that being said we get to visit two other people we got sam's coin which is cool don't know what we're gonna use it for but let's go ahead and let's run let's see wait is this the way no we just let's go over here let's see if it's over here music is actually kind of catchy. Oh, this seems to be leaving, looks like. Alright, so instead of doing that... Oh, it's right here. Okay, cool. Let's go right here. Huh. I guess they're closed right now? Yeah, it looks like they are closed right now. Let's go in here. What is this? A uh, shop? See the sign out front? All I got is materia. That's cool. That's all I want to do is buy materia. 
Let's see what he's got. He's got fire, ice, lightning, poison, barrier, deadly dodge. Dude's got a lot, but I think I'll keep my money. Thanks, buddy. Mm, goodbye. So let us go ahead and head out, and let's try to figure out where this other... Is there something around here? Oh, you know, we just came from... Okay. Yeah, let's go ahead. Let's run back this way. And let us try and find the other... Other Step place right that we Step need right to go to. Now, this is where we came in. And we got our bearings. Let's go ahead. Let's try down here. Seems like we're getting closer. Uh, over here. Go up these steps. And... Look at this. Looks like a nightclub, huh? Look at Johnny. Johnny, Johnny. Yes, Papa. Damn, man. This the place? What's it supposed to go down like so. this? Uh, Let me handle just this. just wanted to see Andrea. You wait out here, okay? Then why would I do that? No, like, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Alright, let's go ahead. Let's walk in and see what we got. Good evening. Oh. Hey, uh. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh. We don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required. And the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes. Well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare. But Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry, but there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Alright, so it looks like we've been rejected twice. I wonder how... <sighs> We're gonna get this figured out. Huh. do is get up out of here, right? We go this way. Looks like we can. And this takes us back to where we were. Hmm. Let's see. Wait, this is. Let's go down here. Let's see what we got. This is where we went. Let's see. Is Sam back over here? Doesn't look like. Nope. We got out here. Oh, that doesn't work. This music is actually kind of catchy. I think I said that already. So bad. Let's run over here. Is that Johnny? Why is he going off? Ooh, we're finally. Yeah, finally. Perfect. Yeah. Welcome. Welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, what manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your mm. first time in Say our establishment? Mm -hmm. We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> And what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, love of Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. <laughs> uh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. 
So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... Hmm... Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! This chick is wild. The strong, firm hands of a fighter. Yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? Hmm. You know what? Let's take... Whoa. Let's take the poor man's course. Do I look like I got money? <laughs> then make your way to the room in the back. And wait. Cloud? I should warn you. This technique has certain risks. Huh? It's somewhat experimental. You may find it extremely pleasurable and rewarding. Or the opposite. Wait. Absolutely not. You asked for this. Now take it like a man. Wow. <laughs> Wonder what happens if you pay more money. Everything hurts. You'll enjoy it more next time. Do come again. Something happened to you in there? Just, just give me a sec. Just one? Uh, maybe a few minutes. All right. Well, with that being said, can I speak to her? Hmm. Is she gonna speak to him? Think you'll make a habit of it? Really wonder what happens if I pay right more then. money. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So? Tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm? Okay. Really? But you cannot go dressed like that. Huh? I could never send Carneo a candidate wearing such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? Um... Ooh, this is... See, I don't want to be rude. Let's go with it matter what I think. There we go. Matter what I think? Well, I think it's pretty cool. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So, what should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. So long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes. For the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. Alright. Well, it looks like we're going to a tournament. 
with that being said, we're going to go ahead and end this episode as I'm looking at the time. I do want to thank you for watching. If you like what you saw, make sure you do like, comment, share, and subscribe. Uh, if anybody actually knows what happens if you choose the different uh, gill option for the hand massage and or if you choose a different option for Aerith, make sure you put that in the comments. Let me know. All right, this Obi-Wan signing off. Peace.